Yeah, I think Ash is here. I'm always ready. How are you? Welcome, welcome, Ash. I'm fine, Ash. Welcome, welcome, sir. Welcome, welcome, sir. Welcome, welcome Ash, sir. Welcome, sir. Welcome, Ash, sir. Fantastic. Thank you so welcome, much. Sir. Welcome. welcome. I don't want to take much of your time uh, because we have uh, many uh, honorable uh, speakers, and I want to respect their time and. Uh, what they plan to do. I'm not sure what the topic is. Uh, I, I know YouTubers, uh, but uh, not sure which area you're uh, targeting. Uh, perhaps it's a vast, wide topic. Uh, I can uh, add a couple of uh, words on that, but I want to uh, take advantage for the uh, presence and the appearance and attendance of uh, our founders here and share a couple of important things are happening uh, in the land of Unpassive, if you don't mind. Absolutely. Definitely. Yeah. Anyone heard the saying, uh, one picture is worth a thousand words? How about a video? Yes. yes. All right. So... Uh, videos are an incredible tool to uh, transform uh, and transfer knowledge and, and exchange uh, knowledge and data and information. Uh, I think it's a very effective uh, one. One of the newest uh, commodities uh, in this uh, age. Uh, I think uh, on the average in the United States of America, we consume on the average, okay, 23 minutes of video every day. Now, it can go up that some people are not watching or a few minutes here and there or uh, not every day. Uh, so uh, if, if you're just keeping it at about half an hour a day, this is three, four hours a week that people are spending on you, uh, or on um, videos, consuming videos in a way. They're, they're just watching videos. If I calculate the actual time, if you go full-time to 100% uh, full-time to any school or university, the, the actual teaching time probably is within that range. So it's an academy, it's a university, but it's very, very dangerous if you don't follow the proper uh, sources of those. It's all about the content. There's a lot of uh, nuts and bolts here and there. Uh, we don't want to get into that. I'm, I'm not the expert on the topic, but I, uh, I just want to testify that uh, YouTube is the uh, the new search engine. I uh, have been YouTubing things, okay, not Googling things. So it's a very, very powerful search engine uh, because you get the visual, the audio, not only the reading factor. But I trust to pick my source. An incredible way of um, describing this, this is an elective, okay, by choice, uh, source of uh, media. If you go to TV, whatever they display, you're just going to have to put up with it. You don't know what it is. Now, if you're talking about YouTube, everybody has their input. Or at least able to do so. Meanwhile, uh, you can choose your sources and you can uh, be uh, particular about who you choose to follow and to listen to. Because nothing more dangerous than giving your time to the wrong source. And and feed your brain with the wrong information or negative information. That is a very dangerous thing. That's just like the uh, regular 
internet uh, 2.0 has two sides you know the 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 negative one and uh, is how you use it so not only the the video makers uh, are responsible for ethical good content you, that is valuable because of the time they're they're gonna uh, take from uh, their following, but also the followers, the watchers, the viewers' responsibility, the subscribers. They really have to make sure that this is your time on Earth. Where do you want to spend it? So take a look at what you're watching. And I think we can have a good idea how you're thinking and what you could be doing in your life. So be very careful of what you watch and you follow. Uh, you have to follow a credible source, a good expert on the topic. I mean, that's, that's a beautiful thing. But... Uh, Speaking of YouTube, okay, I, I think it's a tremendous value, okay, there. It will be there. Uh, there. I am an advocate. I will use it uh, for a, a variety of things. Now, uh, how do you apply this to a passive? Uh, we're different. It's not the same approach. Now, we're, we're going to talk about the leverage and monetization side of it. YouTube is good, but the key to get good profit and good earning and revenue from YouTube, got to continue pumping new content that is desirable. And it's up to your conscience how good is that and how ethical and good, uh, how, how uh, uh, transparent is that uh, content. So you choose uh, uh, the character. Nobody can, you know, screen that. Perhaps you're going to have to comply by the regulations and the algorithm of uh, YouTube and the competition. So you can earn revenue from YouTube. But you have to continue doing the work. Unlike on passive, it's do the work once and leverage that long term. The powerful thing about on passive, not only the, the, the potential revenue from uh, the video itself, your followers are likely your network, which is equal your net worth. <clears throat> and now you have not one thing to sell them, you have dozens endless numbers of values and other things to sell and leverage. Oh, we're going to take it to multiple tiers. Okay, remember, we have a massive disclaimer on every website we have. We are not a get-rich you know, type of business. It's not about money-making. It's not a money game. It's none of that, okay? Uh, so be careful and be mindful that it is a real business, and you can see that things are uh, heating up. I hope you are seeing that. Uh, so we're doing it very professionally. We're a serious business, okay, with, with a, a massive value. And we cannot tolerate any misrepresentation to what we do. It's, it's very critical to us to be uh, transparent and not mislead the public. Got to be very honest, okay? Okay. Um, doing otherwise it has consequences now uh the fact that you can leverage from other products that's one thing but also from your team your followers also have that equal opportunity to leverage so your followers on youtube you have to look at it on on both sides you have a chance to leverage if you continue uh uh pumping uh, new content and publishing new content, okay, that is desirable, that is wanted with high demand, okay? So you have to continue doing that. Uh, the minute you stop, it's, it dries out, okay? There's no income. It's, it's like a job. Uh, exchange your time and effort for money. 
but there's no legacy in it. And then with own passive, they have the opportunity also to profit equally. From your own effort, if you are a superstar, let's say somebody with a following of 100,000 uh, uh, followers or 10,000 or any, it might not be any significant income on you too. Remember, I started uh, praising uh, YouTube. It's a powerful tool. So all the respect. But I'm just talking about we're different and where you want to look at it, okay? Uh, so even if you're not a content publisher, you still have a good chance to uh, also leverage uh, from following somebody who is doing a good content. So somebody is a superstar with 10 million followers on YouTube, I follow them, I'm just giving them my time. It's a one-way street. They make the money, I watch, all right? With um, passive, if I'm in their network and they're following, I have the other uh, products of Unpassive that I can resell. From that scope and overflow of my, uh, uh, you know, publisher or influencer, I can also benefit. So you want to look at it that way. You want to look at it. You can monetize from following somebody uh, through Unpassive whether ONET or, uh, you know, uh, any of our uh, medias, uh, O-Connect, O-Academy, you know, any, any influencer, any speaker, author, you can follow them there. Uh, the powerful thing also, you know, uh, everybody can win the follower, the following, uh, uh, the, uh, and, the, and, and the followed, okay? Uh, that's one thing. Uh, the, the potential of, of multiple products and the continuity aspect of it those three major thing and um, you know you want to look at it also it's a one-stop shop so for the tools for those who are doing the videos uh, they also have the editing uh, you know the hosting all of that without being uh, I would say aggravated by all the complication it's a it's a vast environment and, and there's so much competition on the YouTube open uh, public. So it's a, it's a very different approach, okay? So we're gonna respect what they're doing. I do recommend uh, if somebody wanna do something, do it you know respectfully and do it uh, ethically and be just honest and be accurate with the information because uh, at the end of the day, uh, it's, it's the legacy that you're going to leave. So this is what you want to leave behind you, something misleading, something negative. You're making, uh, uh, you know, a living out of something dirty. So that is something you have to be careful of. So you have to look at the, the source that you're following and make sure that, um, you know, you engage uh, with, the, with them and, and you know, borrow that authority. So if somebody like Mike Ellis is doing a good video, okay, uh, Zafer, for example, uh, Sumlata, they're, they're, they're great uh, video makers. Uh, so if I look at the, their video, uh, I'm not a video maker, example, but me engaging on the comment section, subscribing to them, that is also giving me, the platform is giving me the, uh, opportunity to be known so this is this is how you start you you become an advocate you follow somebody see what they're doing and all that become comfortable do it one day appear with them one day you know to, so start with a comment okay you have to start baby steps right you don't have to do it all at once and, and make you know uh that uh, drastic jump okay uh, many of us get nervous on the video and uh, you know, you don't have that. But I have to tell you something. Everybody has something to say and share. Uh, if you're five years, you know, five years or older on planet Earth, you are an expert in something. No joke, okay? You know something that most people don't know. I don't know. Everybody has something. So it doesn't have to be on the business area. Uh, 
Uh, one more thing uh, I have to say. Remember all those benefits I mentioned on passive. Uh, please recap them and, and, and you know, uh, the continuity aspect. Uh, your followers also get a chance to, uh, uh, to leverage. Uh, the aspect of uh, benefiting and earning from other uh, products, uh, the tools included uh, to, to make it a one-stop shop, the, um, the ability to encounter uh, your... Um, uh, encounter your uh, video. So, for example, if it's on YouTube, you know, it's last year, uh, it's either you kill it or with on um, passive, you'll be able to update that so it can be always evergreen and, and you know, publish that on different uh, uh, mediums. Let's say if you put it on Academy, that is obviously another source of leverage. Uh, but, uh, you know, there's more into it. Uh, the the fact that everybody has that opportunity is great, uh, and 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 you can you know win from those uh, different sources, uh, so it is powerful. All right. Um, one more thing to to mention, you know, uh, the challenge on YouTube and all of those well. It's, it's the king, YouTube, okay? So I don't know if you go to Bing and watch videos or Yahoo, okay? I don't. So it is YouTube uh, and uh, or Vimeo or Vimo, whatever it is. Uh, perhaps um, to, to continue attracting followers and not to turn them off and unsubscribe, you have to continue working and providing content. Your followers, if you are the publisher, if you are the content provider, also have the opportunity to borrow your authority. I can go and share, okay, in uh, Onet Gersminder's video saying, my words on it, so I don't have, I don't necessarily to be the uh, main character of the of the video. I can uh, perhaps uh, circulate that if it's on a different business, a different you know topic. Uh, but very important to know, okay, that with a passive, it's much easier. It's not a nightmare because one video can really make you a permanent start. That's one thing on different applications of Unpassive, but you really have the content with an Unpassive. All you have to do is personalize it. So grab a video from Obless, grab a video from whichever topic or a page, it is there, okay? And there's so much to talk. So you don't have to, to research, you don't have to, make a good offer uh, or a viable pitch to uh, your followers, it's already there. There's plenty of content, okay? And together as a community with all those uh, incredible uh, heroes and uh, qualified professionals within the passive community, we are in good hands. I can talk, uh, you know, more in depth about that, but just, just uh, understand if negative people are following you, you are someone and it's a blessing. And if nobody is complaining about you, you're not pissing off anybody. Uh, Got to try to provide more value and be noticeable in a good way. Okay. Um, it is a good thing. That means you're better than them. They, uh, they try to uh, kind of piggyback on your, success and popularity, whether you're on passive, whether you are, uh, you know, Mike Ellis or uh, Red or, or Mari Di Garmo or Chris or, you know, all the, the Indian uh, and, and Bangladeshi um, founders that are, you know, really uh, committed. They're consistent. And that's a big factor. You have to do that uh, on YouTube to be able to uh, sustain. So if you have people are uh, coming to you negatively, don't be offended by that. It's a sign that you are 
ascending. And don't hate them. If they hate you, don't let, let what they think of you determine what they, they don't even know you. They don't care. They're not looking for facts. Okay. They just want that. Okay. It's a good crowd. I go there and, you know, I try to harass people. Maybe I'll walk away with something. That's not the good, a good way to make a living. Uh, but they don't know better. If all they have in their life to go and uh, invade and, and, and peek and, and stalk us, okay, on different uh, platforms, whether it's a Zoom, whether it's a, a YouTube, whether it's a Google or a blog or something, if, if that's all they have to do, you know their scope of life. And if you're good at it, pray for them that, you know, they don't die on that, you know, ugly act in their life. Uh, not sure if, if if I could be more useful on the topic of the, the uh, on the videos, uh, but I want to uh, emphasize something. Okay, uh, I want to take advantage of of the crowd here and say a couple of things. Number one, uh, I want to thank you for inviting me, uh, and uh, I uh, appreciate you know the the collaboration, the unity that we are. Uh, displaying now uh, it's refreshing to see uh, how we come together from all angles of the globe. That's, that's an unbelievable thing and on passive. Uh, we're solid, we're made of gold and uh, we will win. It's, it's not possible to bring us down. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We, we can have challenges and all that. Listen, I work on problems uh, every day and you know, you don't want to be in my position. Okay. Uh, because nothing nice come to my way. If it's nice, somebody else is hired to do it, okay? It's easy, that's what they do. Things that cannot be solved, they come to me. So all I deal with is, is challenges, problems, you know, all of that. And that's why um, uh, it's not easy, okay? So I'm not saying uh, it's, uh, it's a picnic, it's a honeymoon. No, it's tough, okay? But... Uh, you have to look at the higher goal, okay? You are really changing uh, humanity. And in a, in a very positive way, you are making a, a, a severe positive impact on so many lives, okay? Uh, so uh, it's, it's not easy, uh, but it's a, it's a decision. Uh, I feel obligated to... Uh, deliver the best value to uh, mankind. And uh, for that, uh, we have to be uh, very sharp and uh, polish our brains constantly to understand we are being a target because we have value. Okay. So if you have nothing to lose or you literally like those mooch people that they go and try to uh, slander or whatever. Okay. They have no value. Um, so they're literally just trying to rob and uh, get into somebody's home. But if you have a good value, you have assets, whether it's knowledge, whether it's you know, business or revenue or all of that, that that's going to attract uh, a bigger, you know, bigger circle. So understand uh, it is not the end of it. It's just the start. But we are equipped now in such a way that this will be dealt with, uh, believe it or not. How big is uh, Tesla? You cannot even count how many cases they have. GM. Other, but it, it's going to take age, like year, to get stabilized. That it become like you know a waste of time to criticize something, something like on passive. We are a startup company, so don't get bugged by those uh, naysayers. Okay. Uh, so I think uh, important to know that uh, we have a new, uh, or uh, I would say, expanded our. Uh, legal teams and uh, advocates globally and uh, 
we're taking the protection of our company very seriously, very seriously. Uh, and uh, the the challenges, you know, if they find a way, if it's possible, yeah, they would they wouldn't have a mercy on you. Okay, uh, so we want to protect our founders, our business, our customers, our products, all of that. So uh, one of the responsibilities is to uh, put down those uh, negative uh, tubers. Okay, uh, and we will no no make no mistake. We are on it, and they are not going to uh, escape it. They're going to have it. All right? Believe me. With not only the last video or anything that is negative about Unpassive will be put down. Take my word on that. It will be taken down. Whether in a day or a month or a year, okay, it will not be there. Okay, We already have, a, I'm not going to say the, the, the strategy that we have, but it's going to bite them very badly, okay? So, so rest assured that we are a real company and not only those enemies or haters will be followed, but also a founder or a leader that can mislead the public or misrepresent on passive uh, we don't want to do that. If you feel you've been cheated or somebody told you uh, wrong facts, uh, please go to uh, or email uh, legal at onpassive.com. It's, uh, it has a very large team now that they will look into it. And if you say hello, or if you're like just gonna run, you know, I'm I'm telling you, save your time. It's gonna be dismissed, okay. But if you have a case that need to be um, uh, taken care of, please approach our legal department, okay, in any country. All right, legal at onpassive.com. If you have uh, a case where somebody charged you more than what it is. If somebody promised you an income level by joining them, if somebody told you to purchase or obligated you or pushed you, we don't want to do that, okay? I'm happy to uh, refund any person who's not comfortable if this is not what they thought, even after uh, no matter how long they've been with us. Okay, and this is a rare offer. Okay, most companies wouldn't keep it an open uh, thing. We do have a policy of 30 days refund, but we have not followed that. We, do, as up until now, uh, March uh, 2022, we have not looked at the date. It's just on the NDA for legal reasons. Okay, uh, but at some point, obviously that will be uh, changed uh, depending on, on the package or what we are selling and uh, providing. But until now, uh, because if you didn't hear the message from on passive or those who are, uh, you know, on the face of, of on passive that we admire and uh, appreciate, okay. Uh, if, if somebody really gave you the wrong information speak up and tell us so we can take care of that, okay? Uh, we will not allow any um, inaccuracy. Got to be accurate, got to be ethical. It's a big responsibility. It's a very big business. It's a very big business. We cannot give the wrong information about it, okay? Now, many things are not even defined, okay? Many undefined uh, variables of unpassive. Uh, how, what is the pay structure of unpassive? Undefined, okay? Uh, how much does it cost? Undefined. How much can I make? Undefined. Uh, are you going to make money? No. No guaranteed. Okay. Uh, possible? Yes. Potentially. How? If you resell uh, our products and services or use them, uh, depending on your, um, you know, skill level or ability and uh, engagement and all of that, that has to do with it. So it's not just a matter, it's, it's not a get rich quick. It's not come in and you are a super wealthy person the next month. Now, uh, on the other side, on passive is um, pledging to give 
the most generous pay structure ever created in any business, okay, uh, in any way. Uh, and we have an evidence already because we do that with our staff. We are above average, uh, above, you know, uh, the market average uh, uh, payroll, okay, uh, the benefits, all of that, you know, the, the way we treat our uh, human resources. So all in all, we are already showing the proof that we are generous, uh, unquestionable, okay? Um, now, I just mentioned one avenue of unpassive. How can you, you can monetize that? It doesn't exist, okay? The, the possibility of uh, monetizing the unpassive values, it doesn't exist. So that's one way. So how much is so-and-so going to make versus the other person? It's how you use it. That is a big factor, is how are you using the pre-launch period? Okay, so there's no definitive guaranteed of income. It is not rational for us to tell you, you're gonna make this and that. So no display of income projection whatsoever on, on the videos. Uh, matrix is not uh, a part of Unpassive. That was probably more than two years ago. It's gone, okay? That is not how we uh, are doing it. The price point is different. Uh, the products have increased, okay? So there's so many things that have gotten better, okay? So we said, we're gonna build you a, a digital marketing. We kind of rebuilt the whole digital planet for you. So you got more for the same old $97. We're still spending that, okay? So understand you got way bigger the, the, than what initially uh, we proposed, all right? Uh, so make, make sure the $97 is not a guaranteed of any income. It gets you a priority to have a first look at on passive products, uh, 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 right on the journey with us. Okay. Uh, give us some input feedback, which, you know, has been very helpful, uh, test the products and perfect them and fine tune them and polish them before we roll out to the public. It is a must. Uh, you know, for the magnitude of our products, uh, we cannot just open door and start fixing things and be get embarrassed with the public. That is going to happen, okay? Cars and, and things that entail safety, they get, uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, taken back uh, from the, the market after, you know, being sold or something. So thankfully, we're not to that extreme, okay, we're a digital product, there's no safety, there's no harm, uh, uh, perhaps um, you uh, are gonna be assured, like you, you're gonna see failure is not an option. We're, we're gonna have a perfect product to go to the market that is gonna be a no-brainer decision for anybody to make a transition to our products and the scope of it and, and the many uh, benefits of that. So. I just want to more emphasize than the mechanics and the popularity of YouTube and the videos uh, more on the uh, transparency and honesty and ethical content. Make sure you follow the company's thing. Do not watch something 2018 and come and repeat it today or uh, that has been updated with the uh, you know, with the uh, uh, officials, okay, with the, with the departments, we have revamped our business model to the better, of course. We're, we were uh, uh, just, I would say, a potentially dominant digital marketing ethical company, all inclusive, you know, done for you, uh, automated. Uh, we transitioned into the whole, you know, uh, eco uh, uh, system along with, uh, you know, AI and, and, and our data center and our unlimited uh, uh, factors and everything is organic, uh, made, you know, in-house from scratch, from the ground up. That's, that's, that's not the same game anymore. All right. And um, 
I wish I can tell you what's coming, but it looks like uh, Monday the 21st, okay? Um, I'm gonna have an update, a serious update from that day and on that uh, I need your attention on it, okay? Based on what's happening this week, I'm gonna have uh, an exclusive webinar with the founders. And of course, uh, we will be uh, more accurate with the details. So I think you don't wanna miss that. Uh, tomorrow I will uh, uh, try to be on uh, Lynn and Ron's uh, uh, gathering, uh, Friday night show. Uh, we probably get a chance to also uh, cover up uh, some of those uh, updates. Uh, we had an incredible uh, Women's Day uh, two days ago in uh, Hyderabad. Uh, we have given uh, every female uh, staff member a uh, cash voucher, every one of them. Uh, we have uh, given uh, three of uh, the females um, based on their productivity uh, an iPhone. Uh, three iPhones were given away. Uh, we have uh, given them roses. We have given them chocolate. We have uh, provided food to every uh, uh, staff member and all of that. So it was a uh, a beautiful day, good moment, uh, a lot of fashion and, and all of that. Uh, it's going to be hard to keep up with the content of Unpassive because there's something going on at any given minute of the day. So that's a big, you know, value uh, that you don't have to worry about the content. It's already there. You know, you, uh, you can get some of the pictures, some of the videos here and there, uh, which topic you're passionate about. You want to talk about Academy, if this is your thing, if the, you know you want to talk about O Connect, you're going to talk about IT, you want to talk about physical product. So you can borrow authority. When you borrow authority, okay, what does it mean? It's an instant influence. So let's let's say uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger or Sylvester Stallone or whatever, muscular, big, big guy, okay. If I take a picture next to them, they have the, the muscles or the big body or all that. Somehow it's going to influence you if you're looking at the picture, right? That I'm related to a muscular man. It's instant. Okay. Psychology. If I'm with a politician or a big figure, somebody, whoever inspires you. So if I'm sitting next to them or taking a picture with them, all right, that photo is an instant authority. Wow, I'm with so-and-so. You follow me? All right. So when you have a, a, a very powerful company like Compassive with the so many values we have, you're not only taking a picture, you're taking many pictures, videos, uh, products, pages, sales, all of that, uh, you know, the whole content. So it's, uh, it, you're, you're commanding authority instantly. Makes your life much easier. So there's no shortage of what to say or what to talk about on passive. You know, if you're just going to follow the media or what they're talking about. So you, just today, like, I don't know, seven, eight different publications in India just talking about it, that event and photos and all of that. I'll be happy to share that. It's like, what can I share with you? Uh, so many things going on. Uh, so I, I apologize. I didn't plan to take much of your time like this, you know, though there's so many things I want to cover, but, uh, but I have a huge week here coming up. Uh, and uh, based on that, uh, we'll have a good uh, gathering uh, uh, post the 21st. Uh, that will uh, definitely reveal uh, some, uh, uh, you know, major steps ahead. Oh, yeah. Uh, so for the founders, I think you are noticing it is not necessary for you 
to to get founders okay uh just for the number just see what we're doing we're actually interested to do some i don't want to see to say cleansing because we're talking about human beings but i'm i'm happy to um sort out the, the the value and make sure that we have the, the the best quality of the founders that really can make a fit not just because they afforded or somebody paid the $97,000. That is not a qualifying uh, point. Okay. Speaking of, uh, of qualifications with the, with the YouTube, okay, your followers are not buyers. I'm just saying, okay. And they're not qualified, meaning we don't know. I mean, anybody can open a Gmail account and, and you know, subscribe or whatever and watch you. It's open. We don't know if they're real people or a cat or a dog or a dead person or a person with so many, you know, fake emails. We don't know. But with passive, those are verified, qualified buyers slash followers. Huge. Okay. I uh, thank you for listening to me. I'm going to just uh, sit back and listen to the rest of the speakers. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ash. Uh, uh, Guspinder, you want to say something? <laughs> yeah, thank you. Uh, thank you, Ash, for um, uh, coming. And uh, uh, just uh, listening to you is uh, much, much, uh, uh, so much of value, uh, you know, and uh, uh, talking of, of uh, today, uh, uh, social media or YouTube, uh, yes, really, uh, it has, we, like, it, it's a huge, huge platform. And, uh, uh, if if you can uh, like I I was having a question like uh, uh, with going with our uh, uh, own net and uh, so what can we expect from uh, like uh, a difference uh, in own net and the other social media uh, so I just wanted to know that from you sir. I apologize. I didn't expect we're going to go over questions, but we will honor this. And um, uh, so whatever we do, it is uh, not a copycat of uh, uh, what's available and it's not reinvent, uh, reinventing the wheels. OK, there's no use of that. So anything we do, it, it has a purpose. It has a reason that is missing. OK, whether, you know, the the ethical uh, practices or lack of it, okay, or uh, the, the the integrity of, of you know the all of those reasons, you know, and some technical purposes, the limitations, the restrictions, the biased, you know, all of those uh, variables. So there is more of a hu humanized uh, element of of our uh, approach in every product we do we we work with heart we work with conscience we work with uh, you know uh, with with that uh, human uh, parameter and and human uh, i would say accountability on every step we do okay we don't just want to do it for profitability or popularity that's not our purpose it is quite the opposite uh, I do uh, uh, want to mention there are a few products are I can uh, reveal to you today that uh, maybe I can list them if you don't because onet is one of them so I'm gonna name a few products okay and those products will be uh, revealed, released within, I mean, some of them are days, but I are ready uh, just about the release, but I'm just saying uh, without any uh, surprises, uh, within the next 60 days, the following will happen, okay? Uh, you already know about uh, O-Tracker, okay? That's already done, okay? But uh, we will have a O-Founders, uh, multi-regions and the new database structure just about any day to go live, okay? They're 
uh, we, we've been doing testing for the last couple of weeks. And you probably think that's all we have with uh, O founders. Uh, so that will, uh, you know, just about any day, uh, we're going to take that extra uh, boost and, uh, and you're going to see the difference, okay? So uh, this will be the, the time when I say, okay, we nailed it. Uh, o founders is uh, stable and permanent. Uh, and that includes the uh, O network uh, side and, 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 you know, the updates and O founders and all those uh, parts uh, will be all clarified. So O founders, obviously within the next 60 days will be where we will announce it's permanent, it's done, all of that set in stone and going to be a part of um, passive uh, moving forward, not accepting new founders, but Obviously, it's just a VIP club, if you wish, within the Unpassive uh, Massive uh, platform. Uh, o Connect, all right, it's already in testing, uh, testing in progress. Uh, it has to do something with the database as well. So we are also going some uh, over so many major, major steps in our journey. Uh, Academy, Opeer, Obless, and uh, Onet. So it is one of them. And Odesk. All right. So that is going to uh, be a chat application for customer success team. All right. So we're going to have it where you can chat directly. Uh, so O chat O desk, so that it's it's going to go live technically. Uh, speaking of that, uh, very very soon we're going to have a, a landline where you can call almost around the clock. Okay, uh, for our support uh, uh, reasons. Okay, we call it customer success now. So if you also uh, uh, have any uh, suspicious. Uh, activities you want to report to our legal department or uh, speak with us and clarify if you feel you were misled, uh, you can speak with somebody and uh, provide the information so we can take uh, immediate action uh, to uh, protect you. Uh, so the uh, AI uh, ML part of what we uh, have in ONET, I think it will be more relevant, uh, the scope of uh, other values that you have, the content, and you have many things to sell, and uh, plus you think, so it is more meaningful to me than just a, a chit chat, uh, you know, uh, I would say gospel, not from a religious perspective, I'm just saying just a chatter. Uh, nonsense. No, it's not none of that. Not envy. Not you know jealousy. None of that. You know, uh, showing foods and uh, uh, what are you wearing and all. None of that. Uh, you know, nonsense. So it is a, a professional approach, uh, and it's not a. I I don't know if we're going to call it social media. I don't know if it 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 goes on that line. It's more of a net. Okay, so it's it's more of a network with professionals, I, I, I don't prefer to say like LinkedIn because it's more hiring, recruiting and resumes and CVs or whatever uh, on, uh, on, on LinkedIn. So it's, it's different, okay? Uh, but, but I would say that would be closer uh, in, in terms of value more relevant than if you say Facebook or Instagram or, you know, and, and it's all of them. So you want to publish um, a video, it is there. Okay, so that part is, I think it's YouTube. Okay, uh, it is um, audio, which is rare. I mean, we don't see that much. Okay, um, photos, images, okay, Instagram or the other. So it's, it's really uh, a more complete professional meaningful uh, set of features uh, driven by a uh, speaking of AI ML uh, we uh, 
we are at a point that we can have, we can say uh, we have a data science uh, department, okay? So we used to have, uh, you know, a couple, uh, you know, try, like, you know, of those uh, high, high, rare, rare skills that you, you find and, and, you know, have them work on so many things. But now uh, we're, we're shaping up where we have real experts, okay? Real experts, like people from the very beginning of this uh, trend. And uh, I, I think, you know, it's fair to say we have a, a, a complete department just for AI, uh, data science, and ML machine learning. Uh, so it's it's different, okay? And the monetization aspect of ONET, I mean, what, what do you do on Facebook? And again, you could be a fan, you can do it. I understand this is what's available, but I choose not to waste my time on anything. And you probably could tell, okay? Why am I going to go there, okay? So I choose to make my time more purposeful, more meaningful, uh, you know, uh, on a strategy, on point, have an agenda. I select and choose what I want to fuel my brain and spirit and all of that. I'm going to go and just watch what people do. And, and it, I don't care about what I do. I mean, in terms of the hygiene stuff or whatever uh, and, and, and fooding and all of that. So this is irrelevant. Yeah, it's, it's a side chat, you know, one-on-one. -on -one. That's like a topic, but, but you don't take a million people followers time to post what smoothie you're drinking. Or showing off a new gadget or outfit that you just bought. Come on, it's an insult for our intelligence. So uh, so I, I, I really want to refuse to be labeled as um, Facebook or a replacement to that. It is different. If you believe in those, I'm not telling you leave them, okay? I used to say ditch it, okay? But it's up to you. If you want to waste your time, waste your time. And I don't mean it, okay? It's But it's your decision. I, I choose not to. Um, and uh, we are more, uh, I would say, value-driven. So the, the, the other way, uh, of, you know, the, the traditional fa uh, social media, you are the product. You are the user, you are the victim, you are the manipulated, okay? You are the product. And without you, they don't make money. And who is making money? Them only, all right? Whether the owner or the, the company itself, all right? Very different here, okay? You are a part of the business. You are not the product, the confidentiality, the, the, the privacy aspect, everything is encrypted. Everything is encrypted, okay? Uh, one hundred percent. What uh, me, uh, encrypted um, is is your data is anonymous to us. We don't store it. We don't. Um, it's. I mean, it's codes. Okay, we cannot read it. Okay, it is. It is computer structure. It is, you know, uh, machines language that we don't know. We cannot decode it. It's up to you what you want to display, but I cannot see what Eugenie is talking to uh, Mike Ellis. I can't if I wanted to, if they're talking privately. Very different. I don't want to have that model. Okay. I don't want to have that liability. So, what is the difference between traditional social media and ONET? There's nothing in common, to be honest with you. So it is, it is much easier to say um, it is not like traditional social media and probably it wouldn't fall under the social media aspect, all right? And uh, we are completely um, subjective and unbiased and we don't get involved. I, we do, it's, it's not my business to know or to control what Charles is talking to Jeffrey or, or Julie talking to Neeraj or Susie, that, uh, Susie. That's not my, you know, right to know. Therefore, resell it 
okay? A couple of women, you know, they're shopping for their, can I say underwears, okay? And why does Facebook do, has to know about that? And then the next time you go, you're just seeing, you know, all those lingeries and bras and, you know, and then your kids or whatever come and see that. Like, so uh, with models or some revealing stuff, I'm just saying, it is not my right to know what goes between two other people if, if they don't choose to uh, put that publicly. So privacy and, and respect to others, um, you know, confidentiality, that's a big deal for us. And I have to tell you something. Uh, people are kind of like, okay, uh, at a point, they're tired of Facebook. You probably could be one of them. It's like, okay, got it. it was nice. But it's time to kiss goodbye, you know, adios, because it's it was a, a, a trend. Okay, I get it. I can chat. I can talk to somebody, uh, post my uh, Photoshop, you know, or Photoshop uh, images, right, to look better. It's, 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 it's really misleading. It's like given an image that we're not it. You don't see the ugly of, of the side. Like people are, if you see a couple are hugging and, and, you know, cuddling and showing my hubby or my wifey or all of that, I'm sure you see all of those every day, right? I, I don't know, but I just have a good feeling that they are having some issues, Okay. I wouldn't do it if everything is fine. Why are you trying to tell the world, okay, what's going on with you and that you just got her a bunch of parsley, I mean a rose, uh, why? You see, so, and I think we got the, the numbed, okay, uh, rush of that social media 10 years ago, but, but it's over. People like a sugar rush. Okay, we got it. Now, hey, we're aware. Uh, like, time to, to look up for ourselves and make sense of our life, okay? So I think it's, uh, it's, um, it's not on the way up, if I wish uh, to, to tell you my projection, okay? Of course, if they can change their uh, dynamics, yeah, of course, you know, it can be valuable. I'm not judging, okay? I'm not, I'm not in any way <laughs> undermining their, their success, their popularity, but I, I, I don't really think it's the cleanest business model that I want to do, okay? Because it's based on manipulating others' data and privacy and, and consuming the time, which is the biggest asset we, we have in our life. You know, taking taking time from uh, from you uh, every day, uh, it's more than money, okay? And the money they make off you is just staggering. So all in all, I'm, I'm really shocked that we are tolerant to <clears throat> such a model, okay? Uh, but it, it definitely is on the way out, okay? It is on the way out. There are more rational things. That, that creates a vacuum for logical, realistic, respectful solutions like on passive. You follow me? Yes. Okay. So, again, I'm not opposing that. It is what it is. It's your choice to be sold and manipulated if you wish. But when you have the unpassive solution or solutions, um, it becomes your responsibility to make a, you know, logical, rational move and solution. Uh, yeah, so um, I, I just never got it, to be honest with you. Not that I didn't want to or just like was blocked. I'm open-minded. Yeah, I want to. 
be cool and have swag and but you cannot fool me it's it's really nonsense uh if i wanted to share something with my family will i share it with my family right like a picture or a photo okay why um you just go straight to your family like whether the extended family or um yeah you just do it internally you don't have to put it under the sun um that's one thing. If I need uh, to publish a content or I want to build a business, I don't go to Facebook. I create my own website, my own content, my own pages that they don't control anything. And it's relevant and no misleading, no taking, chewing time of people's life. For God's sake, the time they, they take is the biggest robbery ever existed in history. Okay, if you think about it, like calculate the time people spend on Facebook or, or those nonsense, uh, uh, you know, platforms. If you calculate the time they sucked our, uh, off our life as humanity or humans. And, and how do you assess that in money or, or billions? Oh, yeah, how, how is Facebook making all those billions? By using you, billions, by, and what impact are they making other than jealousy, envy, uh, exploiting, damage? You think more people got married or divorced because of Facebook? I wonder. So, <laughs> uh, I think it's a fun topic. We don't want to take your time here on that. So please, uh, don't ask me more questions, Gospender, okay? Thank you. Thank you, Ash. <laughs> thank you so much. You really space, uh, spoke with uh, such a different uh, angle. And uh, yeah, it's uh, always we have time <laughs> with the, all this uh, nonsense going on. on it bothers media, me but... when somebody says, uh, like what? I'm unlike anything. If I'm like, I'll be an idiot if I'm just revamping things or, you know, refurbishing, okay? We're a new creature. We're a different animal. So it does bother me to reference on passive to anything else. It's just hard. And that's why we get beaten up every day because it's people don't get it. I don't, I'm not like Facebook. I'm not like Zoom. I'm not, so what are you like? I'm on passive. This is my identity. Okay, hasn't been done before, never been done before. So you just have to open your eyes and pay attention and then you will see it, okay? Or you should be seeing it by now. Uh, but, uh, but it's a massive statue and we're just revealing those parts now. But once we, oh my God, this is not what I thought. Okay, you're, you're having a projection or perception. What is this? And because you have those, uh, outdated thoughts. Okay, so oh, net, yeah, social media. No, it's not. Okay, why would why would why would I want to get into that? Okay, previous uh, a former president uh, created uh, a social media alternative. Took a year to create a platform. I think a billion dollar budget, and still not going anywhere. So it, it it's not going to replicate. I mean. Facebook is going to be Facebook. It's an era. Twitter is going to be Twitter. Instagram is going to be everything. I'm not, you know, it's a part of the evolution of, of, of this digital, you know, planet that we have. Uh, but, uh, but I wouldn't try to replicate something. I believe it's already broken. Needless, you know, or, or the other way around. Like, why would I want to replicate the ugly? Like, like you have an ugly child and you wish you, they were a twin. Or if you had a few children and they were all ug ugly, let's say you got five, dumb ugly, okay? And you're still trying to make more babies. That's it, you get, get the mammal, they're ugly. You're making ugly babies, so just let it go. 
Okay, that's not your thing. So unless you have a chance to make a new beautiful baby, and I'm sorry, that's not, I'm, it's not an, in any offensive way, it's just humorous. If you don't get it, you know, go take a pill. Okay, uh, so <laughs> just, just understand, I am not here to remanufacture what I believe is already broken. Okay, I am making something more handsome. Look at me. Do I make anything handsome? No. <laughs> Absolutely, yes. Yeah. You are handsome. We are handsome. One passive is handsome. <laughs> Every founder is a handsome. Oh, thank no. You, thank now you, you are in trouble. Okay. You're okay. Are you a sexist? Okay. So, on passive, is, is it a he or a she? No answer. <laughs> don't, don't, don't answer. <laughs> All right, take it away, please. We're taking uh, you know the time of other uh, speakers. I did not uh, want to take this much time. Okay, so uh, uh, YouTube is a great tool. Uh, just be mindful of, of you know taking people time. You know, do something ethical, clean. Don't just you know do it to make a quick dirty buck here and there. Do it for the right reasons. Okay. Um, do not follow, nobody's going to be you and you're not going to be anyone else. Just be yourself, okay? Uh, you do have a value to share. Uh, uh, you know, our approach in our passive is more purposeful in any product that we have. It is more meaningful. It is more, uh, uh, it has more leverage. Uh, it is uh, more expanded and broader in many ways. It's limitless. Uh, so they, there's no contrast. It doesn't make sense. It's unfair to, to reference on passive to anything else. So that's important. Okay. Uh, if you are not the video, the content maker, no problem on passive is doing the work. You know, we're providing the content, all of that on your behalf. So uh, you're fine. You're not left behind just because you're not good at uh, YouTube and or making videos. Uh, the other element of, you know, the legality and, and all of that, uh, like I said previously, but it's already happening, okay? We are taking our protection, the protection of our customers, founders, our products, our, you know, existence, all of that. We take it dead seriously, dead seriously, okay? If somebody's messing up with us, I'm just, you know, pray for them, all right? So we, uh, uh, we have spent uh, enormous amount of millions okay and um non-stop around the clock i cannot calculate the man hour we put into this the challenges the sacrifices the the, the blood and tear uh and still going on okay uh the the investments the properties all of what we do the inventions the 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 human the the intellectual property that uh we possess thankfully as a collection, uh, it's limitless, uh, and uh, we cannot uh, tolerate somebody to come and rob us or uh, undermine the value and the purity of this business. We cannot allow it. And I uh, think you mostly know that I'm a forgiven person, I'm easy and all that, but unfortunately, um, it gets to a point where you have to prioritize the uh, values, okay? So my reputation is more valuable than any potential revenue. Understand that. So, so if somebody going to slander that, mm -hmm. I'm not going to tolerate it. That applies on every good leader founder that we have, okay? Uh, the, the hard work that we want to provide and, and, and give to humanity as a, as a legacy, uh, I cannot allow somebody to manipulate it or um, abuse it. The fact I'm, I'm creating platform solutions to conquer issues in the world, okay? Um, and we will, make no mistake, on passive, will eradicate many things, okay? Uh, 
780 million people have no access to clean water. Today, 2022, we do have enough water on the planet, but they are dying out of that and illness and you know so many ugly stuff, okay? Um, I think you will witness on passive in your life doing something about that, if not com completely eradicating that, okay? Uh, just add another, you know, 100, 200 million, eight to 900 million people go to bed uh, hungry every day. I do have a genuine, serious solution, intent to solve that. And somebody getting in the way, okay, to, to educate the, you know, the children or, or, you know, those who are in persuasion for the uh, for education or a higher purpose in life okay uh, somebody to come and, and cut that to cut you know the the many hundreds of employees we have to cut their throat and the the source of income they have for their family they're comfortable with it they made a move from state to another to to all of that to adjust with their new life in on passive and somebody just oh, you're not real come on okay you think we're gonna you know Baby said that no. So understand, the the priority is massive between what we used to be three years ago and where we are today. We cannot allow anybody to spoil this massive value that will uh, return to us. I, I have to say something. I. Uh, Maybe I should say it tomorrow on uh, on Ron's uh, and 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 Len's uh, uh, meeting uh, because uh, I want to make sure I uh, I check if I can share with you. Okay. Yeah, uh, but but the the scope of it uh, on passive will make not an impact on humanity that will be hundreds of years in the books of, of, of any his, historian, okay? Um, no, it will make an enormous, gigantic impact for disruptive reasons, for reshaping our life totally. I'm talking beyond on passive, okay? On passive is just a spark. Uh, those who, who believed, oh boy. Uh, one of the attorneys yesterday said, not only because we became friends, okay? Not only I'm, I'm happy that we're friends, I'm gonna brag I know you. Remember, they know more than you know because we have to have open book, uh, you know. Um, John said, I'm going to make sure and I go tell my friends, you better be a friend with Ash now. Before you regret not being. So he said, I'm not only um, I'm, I'm honored to, to be a friend, but also I feel I haven't told enough friends to, to become advocates. And they don't know everything, you know. They just know a little bit more than you know. Remember, I deal with different countries. So something there, something here, something there. That's why I look ugly, because I don't sleep. No, that was my nature. All right, anything else before I go? Because I have... Uh, only a couple million things to do before I die. Yes, Neeraj, anything else? Uh, any um, panelists want to yeah, uh, talk to Ash? Yeah, I, I don't think uh, I have any questions, but I think uh, Somlata and Rajendra Bhatkar has uh, raised hands. So uh, I hope, uh, I, I'm not sure whether we have time for questions. So, Umlata and Rajendra, if uh, uh, Ash, uh, 
Hey, Nirav, uh, just I, this morning, I would respect this is, the round table on Monday. Yeah, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Mark. I'm sorry. I just, uh, uh, Ash, is, Ash is very busy, Nirav, so I would, I would yes, let him yes. go, please. Like I had to put matches here uh, so, yeah, yeah, to, yeah. to open my eyes. Yeah. Okay. There is there. Thank you. I'm not asking any question, but just two uh, two lines. I want two to questions. Say. Yeah, go ahead. No, <laughs> no, no, question, no, 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 two questions. Are not, you Indian? Two lines. Yeah, I'm Indian. I'm used Hello, to that. Ash. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, first of all, I would um, uh, I would like to say Namaste from India. Namaste. And uh, <laughs> today I'm interacting with you for the second time. And first time uh, when you selected me in the top 10 list and I got the chance to visit Hyderabad office. That was the unforgettable opportunity I, I, I ever got. And, uh, you know, the best birthday gift you have given me the chance to go there. And uh, today I want to say just uh, one line that, uh, for you, just uh, you are the best CEO in the world. I can say so. The best what? I'm sorry. You are the best CEO of the Oh, world. CEO. I'm not a CEO. I'm, <laughs> I'm just a friend. No. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the cake. I just want to check through you yeah. that the, the that cake the supplier, is it good? Yeah, that's definitely that and, was and, an unforgettable and that, that was a... Because I, I pay their bill. We just got like, I don't know how many <laughs> cakes here the other day. So uh, Okay, thank you so much. No, well deserves, uh, uh, Samulata. You have earned it, and uh, I think there will be uh, many more to come. And uh, keep up the good work. We we do appreciate you and all the great uh, founders in India, men and women. Uh, there will be plenty of visits to Hyderabad. In fact, we're we're making uh, an open policy. Okay. okay to you to so allow much. people. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Okay. I have a cat. No, it's a child. Let me take care of them, okay? Let me... Thank you, Ash, for uh, your time. And uh, before we uh, proceed with uh, Mike Ellis, uh, just wanted to welcome uh, Susie. I know uh, uh, I didn't get a chance to welcome you earlier, so sorry for that. So uh, as I as was speaking, uh, Corinne, welcome. Uh, then uh, Rajendra Bhatkar, welcome. And most important, uh, Bill Must. Uh, actually, uh, he's the silent uh, uh, member in the panelists and inspiration to also uh, uh, welcome Bill Must. And uh, Angie, uh, welcome. So, Mike Ellis, uh, the stage is all yours. Uh, yeah, no, th thanks, Naraj. Listen, we, we've got some really good leaders that came on. Hi, Ash, how you doing? You're, you're looking dapper as always. But we, we've got some great leaders that have come in, Julie and, and Corinne and Susie and Marty. Why, why don't we let them uh, have a few words, Naraj? Sure, sure. Yeah. Yeah, Marty or Julie, uh, anybody can just go ahead and pick up the mic and Speak. Well, well you know, I'll always, I'll always say something. <laughs> Me and Julie. <laughs> Julie, you want to go ahead? Oh. No, go ahead, Susie, please. Okay. Yeah. Uh, hi, everybody. Hi, Ash. Um, hi. I, I really um, enjoyed the, your talk about YouTube, and um, especially the points about uh, people having to continue to create content. Um, and I know a lot of people have, oh, leadership stuff, self-help stuff, whatever. And they end up using YouTube almost as a, a teaser to add some value to people. And then what it does is then they invite them to a website where they can, um, you know, have a subscription. So these people, you also use YouTube for that, but they're constantly working, like you said, and they're constantly having to create even more content because they'll do it on YouTube. They give away some really good free stuff, but then they want to get you in to 
uh, like a VIP subscription where you have ultimate access to them. But then they, they're at a next level because they have to continue uh, creating more and more content daily, you know, kind of opening up their whole life to their subscribers. So um, I was thinking about that when you were talking about YouTube, but how great on passive <laughs> is in comparison to that, because all the content is already created. So I just wanted to share that. Um, that I think there'll be a lot of people really seeing the value in all of the content already being created with on passive, that they don't have to be thinking up stuff every single day. So I just wanted to add that and um, go ahead, Julie. Thank you, Susie. Hello, Mr. Ash. It's good to see you. And uh, thank you for being here with us. Thank you for all your mentoring here. Um, it's really treasure every time that you come on to any webinar. Uh, Julie, <laughs> you are a treasure. Thank you. <laughs> you. You are our treasure. You are a gem. And um, all your mentoring here is so valuable. And I, I believe that every single one of us who are listening here uh, on this webinar, we have almost 2,500 people. And then there's uh, a lot of people listening on YouTube live as well. If you are listening to us here on Passive, it's continuously giving the values to the world. And all you have to do is look into wherever the channel that you are listening to. And I'm encouraging everyone here as well. You are going out there and you are representing the brand of Unpassive. And it's you. Remember, we are all founder of Unpassive. What does that mean? We are helping found this company. So whatever the content, whatever the things that you are putting out there is truly important. Um, December 2020, December 4th, 2020, I did not know how to use YouTube. Seriously, all I did was try to, you know, have an email of Gmail, never knew how to do it. And throughout the year doing the Julian Myler show, I have learned so much. And now I am willing to help anyone that wants to set up a YouTube channel, which I did it last week. About 12 people showed up on the webinar. And, um, you know, we literally walked through, hold hand everyone to start going on and how to do it. And the important part is the value. I believe people are attracting to values that you are giving to them. So if you are doing YouTube channel and I would like to congratulate and applaud all the Indian YouTubers, leaders, you are doing amazing job, continue to do it. And it's most important, give the value before you put something out there, ask yourself, will this gonna help someone who listen, right? Will this going to um, change someone's life? And absolutely on passive has continuous provide content for us, right? All we got to do, we don't have to really, you know, search for it anymore. It's at the fingertips, right? Not only on passive.com, the blog, the, you know, LinkedIn, YouTube, everything out there, all you got to do is grab those information and share it to your own audience. And I think that is a very powerful tools that we have in our hand and it's going to continuously going all you got to do is looking at the right information and remember whatever you are thinking every day it's what it's going to make who you are so start in putting information details that is valuable right and that's exactly what the message I would like to share here um, it's great to see you Mr. Ash and thank you Naraj, Gosmender, and all the um, leaders here in India for giving us international leaders a chance to speak today. We really appreciate it. Thank you, Julie. Uh, yeah. Uh, and uh, also, uh, I actually forgot to welcome Pallavi. Pallavi was also uh, there. Yeah. So welcome, Pallavi. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. And uh, anyone else would uh, like to speak 
or uh, like I would I would like to say something, Niraj. This is Corinne Isabel from Switzerland, and aloha to everybody. Aloha, Ash. Thank you for giving me the chance here to me and us. I would like to remind the it's not the difference; it's the uniqueness is the intention. The intention and the higher purpose, where have you seen and where have you felt in any, any business? Tell me where this intention of love of the higher purpose of our lifting humanity for humanity, for us. This is, this is unique, never seen before, you know. This is a living being to me on passive, has a spirit where a business and a company has a spirit, a living spirit, a real living spirit, which is breathing with us, which is living with us, which is sharing with us, which is caring for us. And uh, that's why I understand. I don't want to be fooled. I'm not a fan of, I don't want to take uh, this in the name because I feel the intention of this social media you, you said before. And that's not, there is, which intention is that? There is no good intention. So if something is not in frequency with the genuine intention, don't touch it you know? and feel it. You just have to open your heart and feel if it resonates with love. That's very easy. And um, to, I just want to remind, this is the highest reality to me is love and on um, passive is full of love. It's made up of love. It's the mother of all businesses. We have celebrated the, the International uh, Women's Days last and, and, and we, we had this powerful, you know, the divine feminine, but we are including the divine masculine. We are including us. Everything is inclusive. Everything is complementing. We are uniting every potential. This is unique, not splitting, but unifying. United we are, and we can make the change which we already do now, and we are. We are. So many projects are running already now, and I'm so happy to be integrated in a few, um, yes, wonderful projects with a higher purpose, aligned with on passive consciousness, aligned with on passive lifestyle, aligned with on passive intention. So that's to me the most important. It was just a remembrance, and thank you for being thank you, always Corinne. Alive. Yeah, you. wonderful to hear you, Susie, Julie. Uh, great uh, points. Uh, uh, on passive women uh, so uh, lovely uh, I like the word uh, spirit we are AI with heart and a business uh, with spirit thank you for that Corinne and I think you can uh, collect royalty on that so uh, a couple of things if I can uh, add before we uh, uh, take off for today meet another day The completion and the integration that uh, Corinne talked about, that is unmatched, okay? Um, not only you, you find other elements of the business within, such as the tools, all of that, but if you look at what's available, again, focus on the concept of influence, Influencers, publishers, it's, it's the two sides of it. The recipient, the consumer of that content, and the publisher, the provider of that. Up until now, if the, the content is really not that valuable, um, you're just enriching somebody and making them you know, more popular and at your cost which is your time. Unless you get that one time value uh, of the benefit, but with the unpassive approach, and, 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 or let's flip the, uh, the coin. If you, um, if you are, let's say in YouTube and you have a million followers, that's a lot of followers, right? What if you want to send them a message today? Do you have that tool? 
Do you know who they are? Anything about them other than number? Statistics. Are they real? Versus on passive, every click, every motion, every impression is transparent, is real people. We don't have vague statistics or anonymous identity. Everybody there is a real human. So, uh, and you have real tools to approach them. Uh, you uh, have a, a video, you want to contact your video viewers or who shared it. You want to target a different country. You want to see more in depth, okay, their email addresses. It's a big difference. So that's why it kind of bugs me when you say like, like, no, we're unlike any of those. Okay, so uh, the, the, the road we're on, and it's not a project, Korean. come on, it's not a project. We're many, 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 many projects. So it makes it a journey or a lifetime mission, legacy. It's so many projects on passive, so many areas of our life. Um, I just hope you see, I take pride of who we are and uh, we are not just another thing. We are on passive, all right? It's, it's, it's just what it is. Uh, so uh, that's one thing. Uh, and the, the tools to be able to follow that, they, they make the difference because the key is in the follow-up, the key Success is in the follow-up. And if you want to continue attracting or your, your followers and, and giving them you know, uh, content, you're going to have to continue creating that uh, content constantly and be relevant. With us, uh, you can have you know, follow-ups, information, addition to that, it's evergreen. The word is evergreen. It doesn't die. You can make it constant, constantly relevant. It's a big deal. Uh, I'm just in a position where uh, I'm so proud of where we are. I wouldn't choose it differently. I don't wish it was any easier, okay? Uh, it is make us, making us uh, stronger. Uh, I, uh, I understand that we have to up our game, okay? We just have to get stronger to beat those and, and, and overcome those challenges and those barriers on the road, and they will not stop. So uh, choosing easy is not our thing. And those who... Uh, chose to be uh, no one, you could do that, okay? Uh, or you could really uh, pinpoint or identify your passion and work on it. It doesn't have to be what anyone else is doing. Something that you really like and love. Make sure it's good. Don't do, don't, do not dare okay to think of something that is harmful or a hack or a loophole or a shortcut or do it right if you want to do something do it right do it clean regardless of others opinion they tell you it's difficult i tried to do it it doesn't you know how many people come and tell me oh i tried to do what you're doing a long time ago and so it doesn't matter if somebody tried or it didn't work for them. It doesn't mean it's not going to work for you. They gave up too soon. You got what it takes. You're more passionate. Okay. It doesn't dictate your outcome or success. Somebody's opinion has no, if it's an encouragement, if it's, uh, you know, uh, somebody's uh, endorsing your, uh, you know, value, it's, it's great. But if somebody, if you believe in what you're doing and it's something good, no one's opinion matter. 
especially if they try to put you down, take it as an obligation that if you have something good to serve or, or, or um, help others on any topic, take it as an obligation. If this little loser going to steal this success or value from uh, me providing this, If I, have, if I have an ambition to solve one of those global issues, I'm not talking about war or politics or any of that. I'm talking about whether starvation, clean water, poverty, any, any humanitarian uh, purpose, cause. Okay. If I have a good plan and I believe we have a good shot to conquer that, okay. Am I really going to be that weeny tiny uh, uh, spirit and let anybody be beat me up and, and steal that potential for it. No, I'll die for it. I'll die trying, okay? Even if, you know, I get any resistance. It's, it's, did you know, I don't know if you agree with me, it's much more honorable and a higher level of dignity to die at a good, clean purpose than playing it safe and die as a coward. It is not an intelligent market out there on the, you know, global scope. It's, it is really, and I'm not talking about on the internet domain, it's like in any sector, okay? Uh, people are infused with the, with the wrong data. That's why we need your support and uh, tenacity and persistent on reaching where we want to go together. Your personal interest is a done deal. It's, it's just an automatic, you know, uh, thing that will be taken care of when you are living for a higher purpose. Okay, Korean can talk about that for probably a few days. Uh, so, you have to, to draw a bigger frame than what was framed for you or somebody's, you know, infusing. That's why the, the, the traditional educational system is outdated. It's technically uploading outdated data to our brains. And, you know, those softwares need to be upgraded, okay? Uh, so, uh, I think there is a faster way. There's a more effective way to upload good knowledge to our brain. Something that we use, not just like dump any garbage there. So don't be fooled with degrees and diplomas, you know, no offense. I, I have them, but they are meaningless. Okay. I've seen dumb professors. Okay. Very dumb. And I, uh, uh, and I've seen people with very humble education and talk in, in terms of the traditional way, uh, but they are brilliant, okay? So that is not what we're after. We're, we're after the real knowledge that is useful and what you do with it, that's the key. You follow me? So um, we are really aiming big and high, okay? So, so don't, don't sleep, don't, don't blink, don't breathe. Not literally, okay? Um, shower. A good side of that, speaking of showers, um, a good side of the YouTube, like we get the visual, the audio, all of that, but nobody has to smell another person. That's a good way. So we, we get two senses. We get the visual uh, and, and, and we get to, to listen, but we don't have to smell. That's a good thing. So some people you want to oh, connect with them. You don't want to really connect with them. <laughs> Just my <laughs> uh, little uh, 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 sweetener for you. Okay, I have to go and... Uh...
good news. Uh, thank you for uh, inviting me here. I just had a new niece. My uh, younger brother just got a baby. She is gorgeous. I have to tell you, she's edible. I just want to go and bite her. Okay, see you. Thank you.